Environmental management is a real passionate driver for this project. BAC is very proud of its environment record and this project is no different. We wanted to showcase our environmental credentials with the new Parallel Runway project. A lot of time and effort has gone into making sure that we're meeting the highest environmental standards. With the dredging of the sand from Middle Banks, we've done really extensive geotechnical investigations out there to make sure that what we're getting is really clean sand. Having had the chance to undertake a trial dredging program in 2008 in our approved footprint, we were able to extensively monitor and study the impacts of a real dredge. The outcomes of that monitoring confirmed all of our EIS modelling. We won't have any of those dirty plumes that are usually generated by silts and muds. It is the cleanest sand in the bay. We have total confidence that we have chosen a footprint that when dredged will have no detrimental effects to the marine environment. The target throughout the project has been to ensure the minimal amount of material has left the site and we've recycled or reused as much as possible. Every tree that we've had to cut down and every cubic metre of soil that we've had to excavate, we've kept on site and reused in the project. In essence, this mulch material combined with the topsoil is breaking down right now to create a beautiful topsoil product that we can use to landscape the airfield at the end of the day. So in preparation for the dredging and the pump out of the sand, we've had to construct a bund around the entire perimeter of that parallel runway footprint. The primary reclamation bund have been constructed to ensure we keep the water from the dredging operations within the site. To be able to treat it so that it can be distilled, any particles drop out and then discharged clean back into Kedron Brook floodway and eventually the bay. When we were originally studying the site we found a white-bellied sea eagle nest. And it nested in a tree right under the future runway. So we've actually built a new site three kilometres to the west in the Boondal wetlands. And we are simply waiting for the next couple of breeding seasons to see it takes up its old site in a new location. I'm very proud to be working on a project where so much time and effort has been dedicated to the environment. We all live and work in the area and we're really proud to go home at night knowing that we've maintained the highest environmental standards at this airport.